Alright guys, so, welcome back to, you know, another, you know, just review. So, today we got the final two FNAF tie-dye pops. I got them both for Christmas, I think. Or well, actually, I don't, I don't know if I got both of them for Christmas, I don't know. But, and then we got the figures, you know, by the way. Why are you here? Get out of here. Anyways, uh, yeah, we have Chica and Freddy. So, let's just get Chica out of the way. So, Chica, uh, she's alright, I mean, she looks the most like, you know, her package art, just, you know, some things are, you know, rearranged, because, you know, every tie-dye pop is different, but, you know, they have the same problem as the figures, you know, we got the black, but it's not as bad, because at least, the, at least they look good, I mean, this, this Freddy just kind of looks weird, like, this Freddy, you know, has a similar color, but I think they just look better on here, like, they just applied them better to the, to the the pop than the figure. The figure is just kind of like a weird fleshy color. Uh, Chica, uh, way better actually. So for some reason they remove like the black rings around her eyes for some reason, which is just really strange. And, you know, they didn't paint her bib, but that's not really a big issue on this one because you know at least she looks good. I'm like you. Oh, I didn't mean to drop her cut. There, there you go. Yeah, now there's really much to say about Chica. It's like this, like, these, it's like a mix of, like, violets, whites, reds, yellows, oranges, and reds. So, pretty cool, but not really that anything too special, too crazy different. Give her a 6 out of 10. Better than the figure, by, but the plush is the best piece of tie-dye Chica merch. I'd say tie-dye cupcake better than these two. But anyways, moving on to Freddy. Freddy is really weird. So, for some reason... He feels smaller, like his body feels a lot tinier than FNAF 1 Freddy's or even Shadow Freddy's. I th yeah, he even feels looks a little shorter. I think it's because mine, I don't know if it's on all of them, but mine's head is like really squished into the body. Like you see, he, he has a clear neck. You can tell he has a neck right there. You know, you can clearly see it. For, well, Shadow Freddy's a little smushed, but you know, whatever. And then, but in his, you can barely even tell. Which means his head doesn't really turn. It might be the same similar situation with Bonnie, but I've had this guy for a few months. His, and his head still hasn't turned, so I don't really don't want to risk breaking it. So, yeah, other than that, though, Freddy, uh, yeah, he's really good, actually. I really like the colors on him. It's a cool mold. And, yeah, I wouldn't say he's, the, he, his colors is like a mix of whites, blues, uh, off white, pinks, you know, maybe a little bit of red in there, purple, I don't know. Like, he has purple on his chest. Yes, don't know, none of these are painted, but what can you really do? They could have made them purple, like, you know, the plush, but... Yes, 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 they just couldn't. This does the upper teeth, just like this figure. And so, overall, Freddy's good. I'll give him a 7 out of 10 uh, for Foxy. You know, I think I rate him like an 8, because I actually really do like Foxy's colors. So, yeah. And then Bonnie knows he's my favorite. So, yeah, I think I reviewed, that's, aside from the 10 tie-dye Foxy pop, not pop, plush, that's all, you know, the tie-dye merch. I reviewed all the tie-dye merch, so, yep. Overall, I'll give this entire, like, you know, well, actually, let's just get up there, rearrange everything, then I'll give a summary. So, overall, this... So this wave's kind of a mixed bag, because I do like it, and I do think it's kind of better than the Balloon Circus wave, but it did have some oddballs and stinkers, like these, well not, I mean, he's kind of starting to grow on me, but you know, yeah, and then, you know, we had really good plushies, like him, and then these two, and Chica. So I'll give this wave just a 6.5. It has some good stuff in here, but at the same time, it also has bad. So, my favorite, if I had to name my favorite, like, line from this wave, it would definitely be the plushies, then the pops, and then the figures. Not saying there's any bad figures, because I do like these two. Actually, let me, I should probably get him up here. Just put him here. These two are my favorite figures from the wave. Bon Freddy would take third. Take would take fourth, and then Foxy. Foxy's just bad. So, my favorite thing from the wave is the tie-dye spring shot plush. He, I just really like him. And then the worst thing from the wave is this Foxy figure. Like. Eh. So, yep. That's really it for this wave. 
I did review this guy's a short actually, I just remembered that. So yeah. So yeah. Uh done with the tie wave. Unless I get, you know, the pocket pops or the or the 10 inch tie dye Freddy. That's it for the tie dyes. So overall, 6.5 out of 10. And you know, uh, I will say that this plush right here is definitely over hated. Uh, I actually don't mind this one. It's not as good as, the, as some of the others, but you know, it's not that bad. But yeah, that's really it. Not really much to this wave. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.